everyone, so welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, what I'm gonna go through with you guys is one way that I helped prep my skin for foundation. Um, and it's more or less just to smooth out any like dead skin cells, get rid of any like block pores, um, so that the foundation can just glide onto your face and look absolutely seamless and flawless. So, I've got two amazing products that I use quite often to help achieve this look. Here they are. Okay, so the first product, which I've researched a lot before I even bought it, is called The Cure, and this is what it looks like. It is a Japanese product, and it's a natural aqua gel. And pretty much what this does is it works as a peel, but it's so gentle, and it's literally made out of, I'm pretty sure, just water and some other stuff. I don't know, I can't like read all the Japanese on it. But this product's amazing, like I love this. Um, it goes for about, about 1500 pesos in the Philippines, um, so that's about 45 NZ dollars. Um, if you're in New Zealand, I recommend that you like go on to Trade Me, they have some of these on Trade Me, or you just like find a website that can send it to you. I also like make a few trips here and back to New Zealand quite often, so if you're interested, um, let me know, I can bring a bottle of this beautiful beautiful product over to you um, but yeah it's it's amazing like it's just so easy to use and it's very gentle on your skin so you're not putting any micro beads or like any harsh stuff on your skin and scrubbing because your face like your face skin is just so your skin on <laughs> your face skin the skin on your face is just so sensitive and very thin like especially around the eye area and around like the vessels around your nose and stuff so going in with a harsh face scrub sometimes isn't the best idea. This, however, is so gentle that you do not have to worry. So I'm going to show you how I use it. So first of all, I always keep this cap on because if I'm traveling with it, um, it just stops it squirting everywhere. And I just like pump it straight onto my face. One, two, ooh, drip, 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 three, four. Oh, little bit of a drippage and then I just use my fingers and I just spread it a little bit just to stop it from dripping and like you do circular motions and you can literally feel um, like a residue or like your little pieces of skin <laughs> like if I come really close you can see can you see all that skin <laughs> it's kind of gross but it's very satisfying no they knowing that you're removing it um, there has been a lot of skeptics online talking about whether this is actually dead skin or not or if it's just the product clunking together and making it um, I believe it's a dead skin because I've done this process like once or twice and on the second round that I do this I don't get as much um, dead skin on my face so it has to be real and afterwards my skin feels amazing like it's incredible um, my like points that I really focus on is my chin because I always have little tiny bumps there so that gets rid of it and around my nose because that's where my makeup like plunks up <laughs> um, and around here because I have like this little patch of skin that's a different texture to the rest of my face and it's right in the spot where I put my contour so I can get like a pure straight contour on this side but then on this side it like because the skin texture is so different it like doesn't stick the same um, I will show that maybe in a future video. So I like will really work on the side just to try and smooth that skin out. I'm just gonna do this until like the product has evaporated. Um, very close to the camera right now, very aware of it, but you can see, like you can see it. Like that's all dead skin. I haven't done this in a while. So like, there has been a lot of build up. So gross, but so satisfying. And then you just wanna go wash your face, which I'm gonna do right now. 
So now it's all washed off, my skin feels like butter. If you're doing this at night time, I recommend that you put a serum or some sort of like cream on your face because at the moment all my pores have been cleared, all the dead skin cells have been taken off my face. So if you want to really get some like stuff into your skin, this is the time to do it. If I was preparing for night, which I'm not today because I'm going to chuck some makeup on this in a minute, I would chuck on some maybe some serum. So the one that I really love is this Lancome Jennifer Neek. I think this is the advanced one. There's, oh, and the youth, so the youth activating concentrate. I love this stuff. Like this stuff's amazing. Like one time I got sunburn on my forehead and I chucked this on the night before and like the sunburn was completely gone. It, it's amazing. This is probably my second or third bottle. It is expensive, but it is a huge investment. Uh, so this would be great to put on straight after you've done the cure because everything's open. The serum's gonna go directly into the skin. Now, if you're having problems with acne, I've got um, another product, so Proactive. I've used Proactive for years. It's probably one of the reasons why my skin is clearish along with other things that I've tried. If you're wanting to get rid of some pimples, oh, the pimple right there. I wouldn't recommend mixing two things though, like one or the other. Now for speedy makeup um, application, I like to use a moisturizer that absorbs very fast, especially if I'm like getting ready for the morning and I don't have a lot of time on my hands. So I use Olay, 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 Olay. Um, so Olay Moisturizing Lotion, and this is awesome because it's thin and it absorbs quickly into the skin. So I will just go and chuck this on, and then this is just going to go all over my face. Like I can feel, I can feel how smooth my skin is right now from the cure. It's amazing. Like it's such a wonderful product. So is the Olay Moisturizing Lotion because I've just cleared all my pores. This lotion just soaks straight in. Like, I can already feel it drying. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you thumbs up and make sure you press that subscribe button because I need some subscribers.